guys, it is just before lunch on Sunday, February 6th. We're gonna go for a walk. I know, but you're thinking, but you're in the car. <laughs> um, we have a wildlife preserve area not far from us. I think it used to be an old dairy farm. That's what I heard, a rumor I heard on Nextdoor. Anyway, it is now a wildlife um, area and they have a giant pond there. It's usually full of ducks and geese and stuff. We're gonna go see if it's open and walk around there. Um, if it is, and if not, we're gonna go pick one of the outdoor shopping mall areas and go walk there. We don't really need anything, but I mean, you know, just a different scenery a little bit. So anyway, we're gonna go get some steps in before lunch and then maybe grab a sandwich on the way home and I'll be back. Good morning. It is Monday morning, January, January, oh my God, February 7th, 9.51 a.m. I just got done editing the vlog uh, for last week and uh, that is saving at the moment and it'll go up on Wednesday. I need to print out the next mood board for the Artsy Trio and February's mission inspiration because I wanna get those done this week at some point. Um, I need to go downstairs and make my bone broth and my fiber drink. I also have laundry to put in the dryer. I did a load of rags last night, so. Uh, anyway, it is a good Monday so far. I have a bone scan tomorrow, so I need to Google where the place is so I have the address printed out so I have the address because uh, I don't have a good sense of direction on a good day when I'm mentally all capable, much less when I'm having anxiety issues. So that's a thing. Anyway, I hope you all are having a good week. I'm hoping to get some art done. I'm feeling okay. I've said still having some side effects from the medication. They seem to be slowly abating bonus points. So yay, that's a good thing. Um, I'm feeling calmer. It doesn't mean that I don't still have some of the mental misfiring issues that those of us who suffer from mental health things have, because I do, my brain still goes there, but I don't have the physical symptoms. I'm calmer. I don't have the chest pounding panic attacks. That's not a bad thing. Um, at least I haven't had. Um, and some of the other physical side effects seem to be abating, so that's good. Anyway. Uh...
Okay, it's been a nice quiet Monday. I like nice quiet days. I'm good with it. Uh, anyway, uh, I printed out a couple of um, prompt mood board things. Uh, one for RT Trio for this month and one for February's Mission Inspiration. So I printed those out and those are ready to go so I can work on those pages sometime this week. Um, I have a couple of journals, I think I said earlier. It might have been in my post in the Facebook art group. I don't remember at this moment, but... Um, or in another post that's coming up. Anyway, um, I have a couple of journals. I just need to finish. I just need to finish some of these. Um, you know, working in your journals is... And figuring out what you like is a lot of trial and error. So there's a particular couple of sizes I like. These little teeny tiny ones are not it. Um, but I have a couple of them. I'm going to try to finish them and then put them away. Um, they're a great spot for when you don't want to make paper clusters. They are a great spot for those small bits and pieces that you otherwise don't know what to do with. So I'm probably going to take my paper cluster trays and use up some of that stuff in the couple of those that I have. I think that's a great idea. I also am attempting to make a gnome house. This is the basic step one. Um, I want it to be sort of rounded, maybe mushroom shaped. It's going to need more of those ribs, but I'm going to let those dry. And then we'll see where we go from there. I don't know. We'll find out. I'll be Morning, back. everybody. It is 9.03 a.m. Tuesday, February 8th, I think. Obviously, we're in the car. It's only like the second time I've driven since I started my new medications. But I'm feeling okay. I'm going to take it eat slow and easy, but yeah, I'm feeling okay. Um, because I take asthma medication, which contains a cortical steroid, I believe, I have to periodically get a bone scan um, and make sure I'm taking enough calcium. So um, we're off to do that today. <laughs> So yeah, anyway, fun times. Then I have to stop at Walmart because I need a couple of things. Hopefully they have them in stock, but we'll find out. And uh, yeah, <sighs> fun times. All right, I'll be back.
a little bit of uh, footage of me putting this together, at least as far as it is right now. It's covered in masking tape as a sort of uh, clamps and um, while well, the glue dries, but this is the start of our gnome house. We've got our front door. This, all this outside tape will come off. This is just holding things on while they dry. Um, but we've got, oops, see, cause see the glue's not dry, but there's windows under there. And I just need to let, it's put together with white glue. So things just need to dry and uh, yeah, stay. Anyway, I'm gonna clamp things together. I'm gonna add some more tape and we're gonna let it dry overnight. And then uh, see where we go from there. I've gotta make a top for it, AKA a roof. And then all the gnomes that I make will go in there and live in the gnome house. But yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing. So I'll be back. It is 10 a.m. Wednesday, February 9th. I finally have a day where I don't have any appointments. Yay. <laughs> um, anyway, I got a roof on the gnome house slash box. Again, I'm not really filming this other than the few clips that you see here in the vlog because I don't really know what I'm doing. There are a few channels here on YouTube that do build like dollhouses and stuff out of cardboard. If I can find them, I will link a couple of channels down below. I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, but anyway, I got the roof slash top built and now it just has to dry. Um, it's all glued together and taped. And so, yeah, we're gonna let that do its thing. And then I guess move on to adding shingles to it and stuff. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. So yeah, I've said that. All right. to break for lunch but look I can't believe I got that done of course after it dries it's going to need to be <clears throat> painted and all that stuff but and the inside is very raw but it's pretty cool all right I'll be back I took the bottom of the gnome house box and I covered the inside with a layer of tissue paper and matte um, deco page um, I also did some texturing on the outside of it with modeling paste. I use the deco art. Let's see, model the deco art one because I've got it. I need to use it up. Um, the roof is drying. When it's done, I will cover the inside of it with more tissue paper and clean that up a little bit. Plus, the tissue paper will also also strengthen it. But first, we need to let the shingles dry completely and. Um, I'm gonna check to see if any of them are kind of loose and it puts more glue and then just leave it leave it sit overnight, I think. Once everything is dry in a day or two completely, uh, all the tissue paper and everything, then we'll give it a paint job. I'm amazed I actually accomplished something that looks halfway decent, like to be fair. So anyway, that's it for the minute. I'll be back. I think I vlogged yet today. It is Thursday, February 10th. What time is it? 1.02 p.m. Don't get excited. The computer is on. 
Um, I dropped my box cutter on the floor, blade side down, and had to repair the floor. There's a little cup tape to the floor over the repair. I know, like, just... Anyway, I did that while I was packing the Etsy order up. <laughs> um, I did get the first coat of paint on the gnome house box and um, on the base anyway. So that's drying. I'm gonna go do some laundry right now. I've gotta take the kids to the airport later this afternoon in a couple of hours. Um, so I don't wanna to get too far into anything that's too messy. Uh, yeah, so yeah, I'm waiting for a result of my bone scan. I don't expect anything unusual. I mean, if they say that I have the beginnings of osteoporosis, I won't be surprised. I am not young anymore and it does run in my family. So anyway, um, that's why I take calcium supplements. Uh, all right. So that's it for the minute. I will say that although I'm mentally like nervous about what the doctor's going to say, I'm not having any physical symptoms and I'm not as nervous as I normally would be, which is good, but different. Okay, I'm gonna try to get some chores done. I'll be back. the roof painted and distressed it's all done that can just dry and it'll be finished I need to continue to work on that but all that white paint some of it's still wet so we're gonna just let it dry I'll continue working on it probably sometime tomorrow um, and if I decide I need to touch up the door and the window frames I can do that but yeah I think it's it's looking pretty good um, yeah It'll be better when the white is either painted over or distressed. That white paint is just a base. Um, I'm probably going to go over it with layers of, um, I have this beige, I have titanium buff, buff titanium. I've got some brown. I also have some um, gel medium and coffee grounds, and I might use some of that to like give it, it looks like dirt when it's on there. So, um, and I also have some somewhere. I don't think it's on the table. I have some deco page, but I have the tinted kind. So, um, and of course we've got inks and things. So we're going to work on that. Manana. I'll be back. So you guys probably all guessed it. So since the kids are out of town, we're watching crazy pants. Yeah. And I was only home like not even five minutes and she wants to go for a walk. So yeah. Anyway, guess what we're doing? I'll be back. Hey guys, I would say good morning, but it's 12.01 in the afternoon, lunchtime. So anyway, the gnome house is done and drying. It's all good. I got the table cleaned off and reset. 
so I can work on some journaling projects and videos, which I need to do next. I also got another new listing up on the Etsy shop. I've gotten like three or four of them up in the last couple of days. Some are digital, some are original art because I just, I have, I can't keep everything. Like it's just crazy around here how much art there is. But anyway, um, so check out the Etsy store. The link is down below. Uh, there are still some purge boxes available again in the Etsy shop. Check the link down below and there is a video for the purge boxes. I will try to remember to link that in the description so you can watch that to see kind of uh, what's in the boxes. The bigger boxes have well over a hundred dollars worth of stamps and stencils in them so you know there's that. All right um yeah I think I'm gonna stop for the minute and I'm gonna go get some food because I need to eat lunch. I need to take my fiber drink. I need to take my bone broth. Yeah, all that stuff. I'll all be right, back. everybody. It is Saturday morning, February 12th, I think. Uh, 9.57 a.m. Oh, I gotta put the coffee stuff away. Uh, yeah, see, Monday's Valentine's Day, so yeah, it's the 12th. Uh, Bob is off getting some work done on the Barracuda. Actually, he's going to do part of the work, but he's having somebody who knows more than he does help him. And um, I'm here with Crazy Nutso Pants, a.k.a. Lily the Grand Dog. Um, and I just got done upstairs doing some computer stuff. I've got to do the morning dishes. Like I said, put the coffee stuff away. I unframed a few old, old things from some 1980s era, like wooden frames um, that are gonna go to donation. And um, I got out a piece of muslin for the inside of the gnome house box. So we're gonna collect the gnomes and they're gonna go in the box and it's gonna go in the front room in the game room. And uh, then sit and do last night's daily drawing and today's daily drawing, cause I didn't get it done last night. Cause we were really busy yesterday having fun with the kids. Jenny and Brian came over. It was so great to see them. They're finally over COVID and they're negative. So they got to come over and um, it was so great to see them. And we made pizza and we watched Drunk History. We just found out about Drunk History. Oh my God, it's funny. The details aren't exactly the way I remember them, but it is funny. Um, if you haven't seen it before, it's on Hulu. Anyway, I'm gonna gather the gnomes up. I'm gonna probably leave one out that I'm enjoying at the moment and we'll switch them out periodically with one of the others. And I think there's room in the box to make more, which is okay with me. And so yeah, let's do that. I'll be back. our front room, our game room. And I think for the moment, it's gonna live over there. There's the coffin box with the zombie dolls and the four horsemen of the apocalypse in it. I think this is becoming a trend, me making little dolls and then a container to hold them. Yeah, I have this feeling. All right, that's it for the minute. Let's get to some chores and then we can sit and do some drawing. I'll be back. Good morning, everybody. It's 10.30ish a.m. Sunday, February 13th. I forgot to close the vlog last night. Oops. Anyway, it's been a better week. Things are going well. Week two on the meds seem to be, seem to be good. I am feeling more creative. I'm feeling calmer, which is the point, right? Anyway, if you need help, seek it. There's no shame in that. If you need people to talk to, find some people you can trust, have that conversation. And yeah, uh, I found out more people in my life are on the same journey as I am than I thought there were. So anyway, all right, we are going to go for a walk this morning and get on with our day. I will fill you in in next week's vlog. Uh, go out and have a great day. Have a great week. Be safe, be healthy, be creative. Go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'm going to get some steps in.